spread out stance, pinch our knees into the middle, weights on the inside balls of our feet, the hand you're not using, just put it on your shoulder, start with the elbow high, you're going to end up down here, so isolating that explosion, blasting phase of your swing. It's nice and easy, work on using our hips. Spread out a bit, pinch your knees into the centre, feel that adduct muscle right there, that's the one that connects to your hips, your core, that's why you want to pinch those knees in. Good. Spread out, you want to get the pinch. You know you're more balanced. Spread out, built for that fast pitch. If you want to mix it up a bit when you're facing the guys that throw slower, you can narrow your stance and have a big long stride because you've got more time to get to the ball. But for this one, you're going to have time to get to the ball. You've got to be short. There you go. It's the pitch you want right there. Your eyes light up. Good. Toss the ball about so high. The top hand's not designed to hit the ball down here. As you can see, that's a pitch better suited for your bottom hand. So when isolating your top hand, work on pitches high and closer to your body, deep contact, or mid-range. Once you get beyond mid-range, then your top hand becomes less pertinent, especially down and away, bottom hand location. Now we're gonna isolate our bottom hand, extended contact away from our body. We're not gonna overswing, we're just gonna focus on using our core mechanic, turning our back foot from our hip, try and hit the ball back up the middle. 